press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. I now call on the representative of India. Mr. <clears throat> Mr. President, I take the floor to respond to the statement made by the permanent representative of Pakistan in the exercise of right of reply in the evening of Saturday, September 23rd. The permanent representative of Pakistan in her statement yet again sought to divert attention from Pakistan's role as the hub of global terrorism. She did so by callously holding up a picture of an injured girl. It was a photograph of Ravia Abujoma, a girl from Palestine. The picture was taken on 22nd July 2014 by an American photographer, Heidi Levine. This photograph was published by New York Times on 24th March 2015 under the caption, Conflict, Courage and Healing in Gaza. The permanent representative of Pakistan misled this assembly by displaying this picture to spread falsehoods about India, a fake picture to push a completely false narrative. Mr. President, in view of this cynical and misleading attempt by Pakistan, we are constrained to show this assembly a photograph that reflects the real picture of pain inflicted by the nefarious designs of Pakistan on India. This is a real and not a fake picture of Lieutenant Umar Fayyaz, a young officer from the Indian state of Jammu and Kashmir. Umar Fayyaz was kidnapped at a wedding celebration. He was brutally tortured and killed by Pakistan-supported terrorists in May 2017. This, this is a true picture. It portrays a harsh and tragic reality, a picture of terrorism emanating from across our borders that the people of India, especially in the state of Jammu and Kashmir, have to struggle with every day. This is the reality which the permanent representative of Pakistan sought to obfuscate. Mr. President, the true face of Pakistan is not hidden from anyone. I thank you, Mr. President.